Hello everybody, uh, Danny Valderrama69 here, um, how y'all doing? Yeah, we're going to do a vinyl update video, I've not done one in a while, um, I'm off work today, so fuck it, I'm going to do an update video. I've got a shitload of stuff to get through, so if I'm just zoom through this, that's why. Um, so yeah, I'll show you my 7 inches first. I got uh, King Prawn, um, uh, Dundays and a, and a Solomon Man. Uh, this is a new 7 inch by them. Um, it's awesome, it's really good. Uh, great to see King Prawn back. Um, me first and the Gimme Gimme's in your back holder. This is on uh, Alternative Tentacles. Um, it's got Fire and Rain on it and uh, you've got a friend on it. Um, Schwarzenegger, uh, Steve Ignorance Band, After Crass, I want a Steve Ignorance Band After Crass, um, this is Take Your Elbows Off The Table, um, Slash Today, um, really good band, Schwarzenegger, really good band, uh, I bought this again, this is the Fucked Up Triumph of Life, this is the purple version of it, now on this 7 inch 3 times, yay, what an accomplishment for me, uh, <laughs> I got this uh, the Wild Arts uh, Red Light Green Light EP. Um, this is one of my sort of all favourite Wild Arts songs on it. Uh, the British All American Homeboy Crowd. Um, really good tune. Uh, right onto the LPs albums now, if you will. Uh, first up, uh, Lagwagon uh, Breeze uh, Blaze. Sorry, um, Blaze. This is on Fat Wreck. Uh, as you can see there. And uh, I've just got this today, so I've not really listened to it yet. Um, so I can't tell you what it's like. But I'm slowly getting into Lagwagon, so, you know, slowly. It's taken me a long time. Uh, next up, uh, the Voodoo Gold Skulls, Who, um, Who Is This Is? Uh, this, I think, is the first album. Uh, it's on Doctor Strange Records. Um, this one, yeah, Doctor Strange. Really good record. Really like it. Um, JFA in the into the Valley of the Yakes. Is it uh, Valley? Oh, sorry, Valley of the Yakes. Uh, Jody Foster and JFA. I fucking love this record. Hardcore and like surf music and oh, it's just brilliant. Really good stuff. JFA. Uh, the Cravats into Toy Town. Um, the Cravats are like a jazz psychedelic kind of punk band. Um, they put out a 7 inch on Crass Records, I've got that, um, they're a, just a, I've seen them live a couple of times at Rebellion and they're a, a brilliant band, really good band. Um, next up, uh, No Means No, uh, Live and Cuddly, um, a live album, double live album by No Means No, um, but it's, it's a really good record, uh, No Means No, I saw them live last year. It was last year, yeah, and they were great. Um, so yeah, next one, um, Rocket from a Crypt, uh, Hot Charity. Their album after Scream Dracula Scream. Um, it's not as good as Scream Dracula Scream, but it is um, still very good. Uh, very good work. I, li I like I like the Golden Dragon on the front as well. Very cool. Uh, the Stupids, Jesus Meets the Stupids, the Stupids are Stupid. Um, next up, Punkorama 1. Uh, this is a reissue of it on uh, like green marble vinyl. Um, every one of these songs on here are brilliant and classics. And like, All the bands on here are awesome, uh, even Total Chaos. And... Uh, yeah, um, Rich Kids on LSD deer on here, No Effects, Bad Religion, Rancid, Offspring, Pennywise. Oh, it's brilliant now. Punk Around War. I've got all of them on CD as well, and I've got the DVD as well, so I've got all the Punk Around stuff. Uh, I really enjoyed the Punk Around series of compilations. So, yeah. Um, next up, Bad Religion's The Grey Race. Um, this is the Grey. Marble version of it. Um, 
on Atlantic Records, not Epitaph. Abu. <laughs> um, after this album, Bad Religion go really boring. Then they get good again. But it's at this point that they get boring. This is a kind of boring record. There's a few good songs on here, but my god, the rest of them are a little bit boring. But this album though, however, is fucking awesome. Uh, this is uh, The Gadgets at Ease. This is on Hellcat Records, Tim Armstrong's record, which is a sort of subsidiary of um, Epitaph Records, if you will. Um, I don't know how you would describe it. It's not punk, it's not ska, it's... I don't know what it is, but it's the Gadgets and they're a really good band. I really like the Gadgets. Um, next up I got these two. These are two uh, sort of reissues. The first one, uh, Pennywise, Unknown Road, and then Pennywise About Time. Um, this is on blue vinyl, and this is on like a grey clear smoke, they call it. Let's have a look at the smoke one in front. Um, there we go. That looks pretty cool. Uh, About Time. Uh, About Time's not my favourite album, Unknown Road is. Um, but I picked up this next record um, and I thought fuck it I'll get about time as well so I found this uh, Pennywise uh, Pennywise the first album self titled got Bro Wim on here and uh, uh, you see that the Epitaph labels etc etc that's upside down Dan well done um, yeah, it's got Bro Him on here and, and Come Out Fighting and the song Pennywise is a uh, top. Really good album. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd forget if I'm going on the, the first one, I might as well get the other two. Obviously, there's, there's more records and then just those three, but for me, those three are the sort of be best of the Pennywise stuff, really. Um, next up, I got this because... Um, Damien sort of told me to get into this band but the Queers this is uh, Move Back Home apparently I've got a, a crap pit Queers album but uh, yeah I'm slowly getting into the Queers it's taken me a while but I'm slowly getting into the Queers and lagwagon and some other bands that people have been getting on at me at though next up Got A Mouth Musical Monkey I like this album this is a cool album um yeah, it's got some really good songs in it. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, I like Gotham. Well. Really like him. Next up, uh, Discharge, Never Again. Uh, I thought I owned this already, but I didn't. I sold it to the previous drummer in that band, Matt. So I bought it again. I don't know if I like Discharge. I really don't know. Next up, I bought this. I don't know why I bought this. The Addict Smart Alec. And then I bought this as well, and I don't really know why I bought this. Is this is the Alex as well? Um, Sound of Music. Um, I don't. I'm not right into the addicts. I'm not really into them. They're fun. They'll probably get fun once or twice, and I've forgotten about. Probably. They've just got chanty chanty choruses, and they've got a really good stage show, and that's why people like them. Last. This is the last album. Um, I've been after this one for a bit, and there's one more album then now to get hold of. Um, and then I've got everything by these guys, but um, yeah, this was the one I was after more. Um, Hello Nasty by the Beastie Boys. Uh, it's, this is a really good record. I remember when this came out. Um, it's on Gatefold, it's on 180 gram vinyl. Um, it's an awesome record, it is a really good record. Just so many. There's there's not a punk song on here. This is just. No, there's not really. No, there's not. Um, but I just love some of the songs. I love the the like dedication song, the one with Doctor Lee, um, Lee Perry as well. Lee Scratch Perry as well. Um, Mixmaster Mike. You know, three MCs and one DJ. There's just a shitload of good tunes on this. And the inserts look really cool as well. Um, that's, that's 
one of them. So yeah, that is all my records that I did buy this month on last month as well. I think I don't know. That was the last lot of records I did buy. So I hope you enjoyed the video I did of me showing you them. them. This is the mayor of the VC saying, "Y'all fuck yourselves." Uh, no, I don't do that. No, don't say that. Um, yeah, yeah, fuck it.